So today I wanted to talk a little bit about the data type called formula when creating a new column. I'm not sure how familiar everyone is with it, but I thought it was pretty nifty and cool. And what it is, it lets you write a power FX formula, little quick expression. And the use case scenario that I had was we have a client who has a BPF and basically any time this field up here, it's called project task percent complete, anytime that is greater than or equal to 100, then we are going to set a field called all project tasks resolved, which is a Boolean either to yes or no. Now, traditionally, I would just go for workflow and change this field, but there's no need because we can use a data type of formula. Let me show you what that already looks like. So I have this field called all project tasks resolved, and all it does is it checks to see if my project percent complete field is greater than or equal than 100, or if it's null, then we're gonna go ahead and say true or false. And it happens pretty real time as soon as at least this field gets updated. I don't need to refresh the screen or anything. It'll just change. I can show you real quick. Let me complete this task. This actually does take a second though, because this is being set in the flow. There's some extra logic that needs to go into it. So let me refresh just so this field will refresh. There About it goes. Sacrifice. So this ended up being 100 head of 100. So then our formula went ahead and did its thing and updated this to yes. I like it. It's one less process that we have to worry about getting turned off or permissions and there's no maintenance once it's created. It's great. I don't know any caveats yet because it's still fairly new to me. And I think everyone, since it is still in preview. Any thoughts of this replacing calculated fields or is this? Yeah, I was going to ask something similar. What are the pros and cons? So uh, uh, one versus the other. I do know right now one of the big cons is that whole numbers and currency are not supported. So if you're expecting an output of a number, a whole number, you can't use a formula or currency. I do know that you can actually jump over one relationship, but again, you can't actually grab a whole number or form. I'm sorry, a whole number or a currency field. Um, I'm not sure how it would work for like rollups, but I think it could replace some calculated. 